is a chronic long-term condition that can be managed but not cured. Asthma affects the airways of your lungs. It causes the airways to narrow and swell, resulting in wheezing and difficulty breathing. During breathing or respiration, air goes in through our nose or mouth to the upper airways, at which point it reaches the windpipe, which branches into two large bronchi to reach the lungs. The lungs are protected by the rib cage, which also contains the muscles that control your breathing. In asthma, the airways are oversensitive and easily irritated by certain triggers, called asthmatic triggers. Most people with asthma are described as atopic, meaning they have an allergic type reaction to external triggers, such as house dust mites, pollen, cigarette smoke, animal fur and chest infections. However, for some people, the onset of asthma is unpredictable and may be caused by anxiety, stress or even laughter. An asthmatic trigger causes the airway walls to swell and the muscles around the airways to contract. The airways narrow and breathing through them produces a whistling sound called wheezing. Mucus is produced from the lining of the airways which clogs up the narrowed airways further and causes coughing. This makes normal breathing more difficult, producing symptoms of asthma that can be mild, moderate, or severe and life-threatening where hospital treatment is needed. The narrowing of the airways is reversible if the trigger is removed or if the inflammation is treated medically. Therefore, preventative treatment is used and can be managed by the patient themselves. An acute asthma attack requires medical intervention, but the type of intervention depends on the severity of the attack. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,